welcome to the very beginning of my new let's play yep. so let's just dive into it I suppose Ooh, sorry distracted sorry sorry easily distracted <laughs> okay let's just jump to into it so I have a couple of awesome mods installed which I'm super proud of I finally got waypoints so and so helpful for me because I get so easily lost and why are, why are you stuck? Why? No, don't. Why? Uh, why computer, why? Why is this so loud? I am s I do not like loud noises. I'm so sorry. That is not top of all. Okay, hopefully you guys can hear me, but the noises are so loud in my eye. So I have my points. That's most probably the most important mod of them all. Because I get super lost extremely easily. So that's a thing. <laughs> so I have a... What's it called? I have uh, an animal mod in, as you probably can notice, there's a couple of different animals in the water. And there's a couple of new animals around, like butterflies and stuff like that. And obviously there's the normal kinds like squids and stuff like that. But I added a mod that adds more animals because I think that's going to be super cute and helpful in my adventure and hopefully I can get some cute new animals ah look how adorable cute me ooh yay and I'm sorry if I sound a little bit strange or weird or ooh <laughs> yeah distracted I don't know if you can notice that that it gets extremely easily distracted but yeah I downloaded that so it could be a little bit more fun and then I downloaded uh, Minecraft Comes Alive mod and it's making m uh, why uh, it's making my computer a little bit laggy it's the same with DecoCraft mod I have the DecoCraft mod installed and it's making my game a little bit laggy because there's kind of a lot for my computer to handle in those kind of mods. And I have uh, the pets. What's their what they're called? There's this kind of pets like bed pets and stuff like that. So I had that mod installed, but I can't really remember what the mod is called. And why are so laggy today? It was doing fine yesterday. It was doing fine. I've been doing some uh, uh, test runs on this particular thing, and it's mostly the one mod that I was super excited for that uh, has been basically crashing my computer. But it seems fine. It's still a little bit laggy, but I think it's still adjusting to the fact that I have mods installed. So I have. Uh, Decocraft and I have obviously the mod that gives me these fairy wings. I think it's called uh, what's it called? It's like a super fancy name. I'll write it in the comment section <laughs> if I can figure out what's it called. I'll obviously write down what I'm using as mods in the comment section so if you guys are curious to see what kind of mods I'm using then you can use them as well. Why are you so annoying with my right now? Why? Why computer? Why? Okay, so I need a place to stay and I need I need some stuff to make a furnace and stuff like that. So let's just grab this. And 
and hopefully the noise just isn't too bad for you guys. It's super loud in my ear, but I think it's just... Uh, just wanting to annoy me, I guess. I don't know. I'm so sensitive to noises these days. It's, I don't know why. But, yeah. But as I was saying, I'm sorry if I sound a little bit weird. I still got a call and I'm still struggling with it, but I was feeling a little bit better today, so I decided, why not record some stuff. Okay, so we have some mushrooms. I don't think we'll be able to use them before quite yet. Um, how late is it? Okay, let's just put those here. I don't want to use more than necessary. And I'm not sure where I want to live. I like this place over there because it's kind of in the middle of water. Well, thanks so much. That's really kind of you. How rude. And it's not nice to interrupt. <laughs> I should have probably watched out a little bit more, but oh well. Oh, poor tree. Let's just try to get this. Okay, let's just fly up here and go here. <laughs> so I kind of consider living there because it's kind of not too big but not too small. But I'm not sure. Or there's places over there as well. And we have this desert area that I really like. Okay, let's just use this. And as you can see, it's certainly daytime. Yay! But in order for me to use the bed pet, I need to manage to find some wool. And I need iron for that. Because I need my shears in order to get wool and um, it's easier to use shears because you get m most of the time you get more wool this is pretty though i don't like you leave me alone and there's a creeper i don't know i like this place though I would like some flat areas where I can sort of expand and be able to start a garden and build my house and have like a nice scenery. So I guess this could be a nice place because I want to explore different kinds of mods. I do have a kitchen mod installed and I do have a lot of different mods installed. I have a Master Chef mod that's allowing me to get different kinds of food as well. I don't know if the kitchen mod is actually giving me more food or stuff. That interests me, but I think it's just a very big tree. So I guess this could be a nice place to live. We have some sugar canes there, we have some water. And yeah, I think this could be a, a nice place to start our home. So let's just make this and then take make a crafting bench because that's necessary as well. Um, I don't know how big I want my house though. I want some wood as well. I like the oak wood, I like this look on it. So let's see. I don't need too big of a place at the moment, so let's just make this. Ooh, tomato! Why? Uh, I see. Hmm. I guess maybe it would be easier to just remove all this, make a shovel and just remove all this and then start building 
Okay, let's make some sticks. And a shovel. Yay! And I got some seeds. Yay! I can make some food. Food. <laughs> I keep getting so confused by that, but that's the bed pets and then the chest. Uh, Double chest pet that's eating, and uh, the chest pet is eating my logs. So, in order for me to feed that and be able to use that, I need to have logs. And in order to feed the bed, pe uh, bed pet, I need wool. And unfortunately, I don't have that at the moment. Well, I'll go out and explore and see if I can find any sheep. And hopefully this video don't get too long because I discovered that I'm terrible at setting timers. There we go. Just getting some space for my house and hopefully I can start a garden soon because that's the main part. I want to have like uh, different types of animal pens with different types of animals I want basic stuff a house to live in and obviously I will probably expand eventually let's see we have some dirt that's lovely try my best not to hit the animals okay so let's Do this, and that's our entry, and then use this. And hopefully, I have enough. If not, then we'll just go back in, grab some more. I think three would be just fine. We're not needing too big of a place at the moment, just something to live in. I don't think I'll have enough. Hmm. <laughs> Let's just put our crafting table there instead. Why not? Yeah, that seems fine to me. And then just... Uh, that should be fine for space at the moment. Maybe a one more. And placing it in the wrong places is always nice. Oh no, the other one. Um, I don't know. I don't need too much of a fancy place at the moment. Let's just make the rest of this except for some of them. Because I still need some more to make our house. Hello, Enderman. How do you do? Okay, and then this, and then... Then hopefully this will be enough eventually. I don't think I do have enough, but... Oh well, we'll just go and get some more. Then just to make this last one into planks, at least we have some kinda. I do want to make kinda the rest into grass if I possibly can. At least so I do have some kind of light in here. Yeah, I definitely need more. But at least we have a foundation, at least we have something to go on for now. Oh no, don't kill yourself, please. No, be kind, don't kill yourself. Okay, um, I want to go outside here. And then... Make another waypoint so that I know where I am. Home. Sign. There we go. I have a waypoint. 
And that's really helpful for me because I'm going to get so easily lost. As you can see, it's still a little bit laggy. Especially when I fly, it does get a little bit laggy, but I'll deal with it. It's not too bad. It's starting to get a little bit better, and as soon as I removed the couple of mods that made it super laggy and made it not working, then my computer got really sad and kept crashing. So as soon as I managed to remove those mods, it got a little bit better. It's still struggling a little bit, but I think it's because I never had so many st much stuff on my computer before. <laughs> so it's a little bit like, what on earth are you doing to me? Let's see, let's get this last couple of wood. Oh, it was a butterfly. I'm starting to get a little bit like, what was that? Okay, let's get the saplings, and I don't know if this will be enough. Hopefully, it will. Maybe just grab another, just to be on the safe side. So I at least have some stuff. I like to be on the safe side, it's uh, easier. Okay. You can fly, Melody. You can fly. Perfect. Let's just get back to our home. Because it's getting a little bit late and we don't want to... be outside when it does. Okay, let's just put our camping bench here for now. And the most important thing to make at the moment is a door. Oops, I need more than one door. Don't want any creepers or anything like that to explode on me. And another one, so at least feel a little bit more safe, and I don't want to use the bed pet more than I really have to, so let's just build some more and see how that goes. Perfect, so that's our foundation for now. And a couple more. I want a roof on this, but I don't know if I want just planks. Let's mix those. Or put them there. Whatever. <laughs> ah, honestly, Melody. Okay, let's just make some stairs for now. And that will be our roof. I'll Let's grab this wood because it's necessary to have just to start our I don't want to find some other colors but for now it will do oh, you keep placing them the wrong place why Melody? I am a terrible builder, I'm just saying. <laughs> ah, give me back my stair. I'll probably go out and see if we can get some different type of wood because I do feel like this is too similar. But at least it's making a it home. At least we have a home. And then let's make a furnace because that's necessary for us to have as well in order to eat our food. We need some coal uh, in the morning, so 
I know I don't really want to. Sorry if you can hear that in the background. Uh, I don't really want to use my bed bed more than I need, but it kind of seems necessary. So I'm so sorry, bed bed. Okay, it's daytime, and I need to really find some wool for my pet pet so that I can get it to leave again. Oh, I forgot to fill that source out. Alright, I was making stairs. So let's just make this all into wood and then just fill in our house so that at least we can be protected from any kind of mob. <laughs> kind of adorable though. And I need some more logs for my chest pad. I need everything to be honest at the moment. So hopefully I can find a cave or a ravine or any- Ooh, there's a little bit of a lag there. Something like that. To at least have some kind of stuff to go on. Because I don't want to lose any of my stuff, to be honest. And I do want glass as well, because I think that would be pretty. Let's see, let's just finish this and... Hopefully we can find some iron because we need a bucket and we need shares and obviously an iron pickaxe for when we find different kinds of fancy stuff like diamonds and stuff. I don't think we will find that at the moment but hopefully. At least I have a waypoint so I can find myself back at home. There's some mushrooms over there but I don't know where I can find sheeps. And where am I most likely to find sheeps? Huh. What's this actually? Oh, corn. I've never seen this before. Hmm. I thought this was plants. Ooh, stuff. Cave. Yay, cave. Okay, I need coal. There's coal, but this is really dark and scary. And but there's coal in here, so let's grab this coal. So we can get some torches, and we can see stuff, and we can smell stuff, and do all that awesome stuff. Don't die, don't die. I think the most lag now is because of all the different textures it has. Like, my game has so much different blocks and things that it's not really used to having. So it's making my game be like, why are you doing this to me? Yay, iron! Awesome, this is a great place to find stuff. And we have enough to make a share. And now my main importance is the bucket and eventually armor. I'm not too fussed about armor because mm, eh, it's important but I'll survive somehow. And as you can see, being a fairy is really useful when you are stuck in a place. And this 
awesome thing about this is that my wings actually never die. This ring that's giving me wings is actually never dying. So that's really helpful. Especially when I'm wanting to escape from places and stuff like that. Because there's a mod I think that gives you fair wings of different kinds. But they do have like the pickaxe uh, certain amount time you can use it and you need to be careful unless you want to break the wings and then that's kind of not helpful when you want to be a fairy. So this mod is really helpful to the fact that I can actually have a lot of stuff and it doesn't die. This angel ring doesn't die. So I'll make sure to list all my d mods. Hopefully I can find them in the description so if you guys are interested in finding these mods and m using them for yourself and finding more and using them to make stuff or be able to be a fairy like I am then you can download them but do be aware this is for 1.7 so you need to change your game to be 1.7 in order to use them well, that was helpful. That was really good. We had a mine, sort of a mine, next to our home. That's really nice. That's awesome. But we need sheep. Um, okay. And more iron, that's really important because eventually we're going to need armor. We do not want to die. Oh no, oh no. Thank you. Hey, go! Oh, <laughs> I was flagging and I was like, why am I stuck? This is a nice game. Okay, so we have plum more coal, that's very necessary. Always needed for coal. Do you think I might go in the nether eventually when I dare to? Because the nether is scary. But not yet, not yet. I still haven't got my farm and stuff like that, so the nether is a little bit far ahead. But I do plan on hopefully going to the nether, maybe going into the end. I don't know. It's going to be so scary. But I think if I get all the supplies I need and enchantments and stuff like that I feel like I need, then I might do it. Because I feel like that's going to be fun but sad. Because I don't really necessarily want to kill the dragon, but I don't know. So that's in the future. Let's hopefully in the future so that we can consider it at least. I think I might do it just to explore and get some different kinds of achievements and see what different things this mods packs has to offer as well. And awesome, we do have some stuff now. So I think this is a nice place to go. And we can go outside without any problems because we can fly. And no, I'm not using any creative sheeps. Okay, so I need sheeps. Where can I find sheeps? Why are there no sheeps here? There should be at least one sheep. <laughs> Why sheeps? Very pretty though. There's a lot of Nice bugs here. Oh, sheep, 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 sheep. Sheep. Why, MLD, you don't have any... You don't have any... Shares. 
Ah, I'm so prepared. Always prepared. I think it's when I'm flying and flying very fast that it's kind of struggling a little bit because it's you have to render all the uh, these textures I have in here. Let's don't use the mushrooms. Take this and make a furnace so that we can have some wool. Very necessary because we need a bed as well in order to sleep not only use the bed bed because the bed bed gets you uh, gets a little bit it's very not it's useful but it's kind of dies very quickly I'll just fly away from these guys and get to these guys and steal their wool. Excuse me, Mr. Skeleton, that's very rude. Very rude, indeed. Why? Why am I being attacked by this guy? This guy? Why? Ah, uh, please don't let me get the sheep. Need more sheeps. Sheep. Come here, sheep. Give me your wool. Thank you, sheep. Ah, this lag is going to be the end of me. Thank you, sheepy. Yeah, I think that's enough for now. And let's hopefully not crash our server by. Lovely. Oh, this is going to be fun. Hey, that's rude. Go away. You're not welcome. So rude. So rude. This is not really helping, is it? Ah, they're so rude. Okay, I need some of this wool. And then this, and then you can eat the rest of that. Just put this here. Oh, why? <laughs> I know there's monsters nearby, but still. Okay, I want a bucket. You bet, bet, need to eat your wool. And I need a pickaxe. Because that's my main things that I feel like is necessary. Can I make some protection? Yes, I can make some plants just to be slightly a little bit more protected. I'm looking very lovely at the moment. Why? Why monsters? Why? Oh well. Let's just put some of these torches here. Yes, I don't I need that much. People getting inside. Let's make some more torches. I know you're there, zombie. I'm not going to let you in. So rude. Okay, I need some chests, so why don't we just do some building then until these people decide to leave my property? Because the pet pet is going to die if I use it at the moment, so I prefer not to kill it. 
So let's just put you there next to the wall and hopefully you'll eat that. You as well next to these ones and hopefully you eat that. Some dirt to make our garden. And some of our food that we are going to need. The plant is very useful. Bone meal obviously is helpful. Bucket we can put there for now. Shares as well. Saplings we are going to use to get some more wood. And coal we don't need at the moment. There we go. A little bit more space in my inventory. I'm assuming even though if I kill this zombie I still won't be able to... Oh, I was able to sleep. How helpful! Yay! No, 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 don't look at the enderman. I know he's cute, but still. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, I guess we'll... Uh, just finish our home for now. How much cobblestone do I have? Uh, 25. Okay, let's go to our one of our caves and start. I need more. I need another pickaxe. Okay, I need some of your wood. And go just makes a little bit easier let's make a pickaxe i don't want to use my iron before i need to so it's not very necessary unless i find gold or diamonds or anything like that or at least enough iron so that i actually have some stuff. Let's collect all these. Let's see if I remember where that cave was. Probably don't. Excuse me. Okay, sorry about that guys. My mom decided to call me and I was like, okay, I have to take this. But I just discovered from talking to my mom that this episode has been very very long and I look super fancy with my pencil so unfortunately I have to call it at this time I hope you guys enjoyed and this wasn't too boring of an episode because kind of doing my normal Minecraft stuff but I think I'll do some stuff off camera maybe finish my build off camera and collect some of the stuff so it doesn't get too boring because I do want to do mostly exploring finding different animals, finding different biomes, except for this beautiful, beautiful desert in the background. And yeah, just do different stuff like that. And I think I'll just do that off camera with mining some uh, more stone and just finish my building. And hopefully you guys don't want to see too much of that because it's kind of a little bit tedious. So that's kind of what I will be doing off camera. And then I will bring you guys in the most part. So uh, sorry for this being super, super long. And I hope you guys enjoyed this. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll talk to you all in the next part.